Goes further afield to Cox. Just one hand, the big man. Got to get it to Varco. Couldn't do it. Go back and track the footy. Phillips, just a fumble with no one there. I reckon Mason Cox here, guys. This was just off the ball. See on Daniel Howe there. And that could, be, could have been real nasty. That's one that breaks a jaw there. Touch, play off. Oh, Rioli. Oh, no. Just that little hand, it gets in. Next goal for the Jeez. Magpies. And this mate come through Cox. Drops what he should have taken. So Hawthorne, too good in the end. 34-point winners. Over Cole. And gets it to Howe. Howe's got Mason Cox on the lead. He takes the grab. Good hands. Collingwood fans rise. Punches it long towards Jones over the top. Cox at the front. They're just running all over the top of them, Collingwood. So Adam Cox again. Oh, he's getting better. Oh, he's, he's getting, getting bigger and better. He's staring at him, Bruce. What has Collingwood unleashed here? We're seeing the future of the game, perhaps. It looks different, doesn't it? Impressive. Can he do it again? Can he do it again? You betcha. Well, if somebody told you ten years ago that Mason Cox would be playing AFL with his background, you would have scratched your head. If you watched him train at that, that first training camp that they had, Bruce, I thought he had no chance. Well, we're all with you. Hey, Dutt, we were wrong. We <laughs> were absolutely wrong. Supporters enjoy the day. Cox, I am noticing that the umpires are calling play on the moment a free kick is given. Here's Cox again for his second, yes! Mason Cox has kicked his second in the first quarter. <laughs> and my chick would have sent it high again. They look for Mason Cox, oh! what a ride! Well, that was going to happen all day, Pav. Loud Cox, the big run and jump. And that was just pretty to watch. A little bit of push and shove in the background on Mason Cox. The Swans got over there trying to set the set the scene in terms of intensity and pressure. We've got a tied up game. Really constructive to go. There's a lot of Collingwood players we're liking at the moment, including this Colossus. And now they can just Collingwood can so control the tempo of yep. the game. Yeah. Langdon on the head of here he is. Here he is. Here he is. Here he is. Cox. When it's high. Only he can reach. And I reckon he'll have a sore body tomorrow because they have worked him over <laughs> all night. Thomas away from the congestion towards full forward. Cox had his jumper pulled. It's Bilster Stevenson at the back. Smart by Mason Cox. Not only does he create a contest, I think he tries to get that to his teammates' advantage. But just set up really well then, Collingwood, very quickly because that was fast ball move by the time. Cox again. What about that? Oh, he huge. turned it. And he said, I've got you in the air, mate. And tackle him hard. Luke Cox, Mason Cox. Now more with the long ball. Mason Cox. Look at that for a strong grab. Exciting stuff from Mason Cox. That is just a great, sure grab, sticky mitted type of a thing. <laughs> this aerial dominance with Mason Cox inside forward 50. Sire. Goes in that direction. He'll get a jump out of two, the big man. High ball then. Cox props and comes at the ball. And he's a hard man to stop when he gets his timing right. He's been goal six times this year, but he's also got a five and two twos. And he's got a single today, Mason Cox. And he's talking about it as well. He's shaping up. A little bit of uh, something's going under his skin. A little bit of verbal from Daisy. Callum Brown shaking through effectively. Back to Phillips. He just keeps on winning the ball. Cox is a long way down, but the lanky Yankee did so well. Looping handball. Meyer check. Penetrating ball. Cox marks. Ball play on. Goes around now. Feels comfortable. Goal. He's got three. Cunningham by 24. 
55 out, top of the square. Where's Mason Cox? Gets rid of one. Bats in. What a mark. What a mark. Ranch wasn't happy. Knocked the ball out of the hand, and that'll be 50 as well. That was just sensational. Genuine contested mark, and look at Cox. Goes past and gives a bit of lip. Collingwood in front. He wasn't planning on that coming off the side of the boot. May just slaps it forward. Cox, this will test him once it hits the ground. Hobbs, oh, went to ground. Big Mason, can he pick it up, big fella? Yes, he can. What to do with that extra handball to another big bloke? That old rule about not handballing to a ruckman. Well, he didn't have much choice there. The absolute elite. Oh, we probably weren't used to it. We are now, aren't we? We know that he is. Oh, I cannot believe it. Hoskin only out of position, but he's still got it to ground. Varco, ground to a brick wall. Thomas, back inside to Mason Cox. Struck it a little thin, and it's just carried. Just scraped through. Cox is the tall tag. That's the one he goes to. Back to Majek, and Majek sets it up again. Cox will get this one, and he does. The first American to play in a grand final. He's had the quietest day imaginable. And he's drilled it home. That's big. Oh, you cannot describe how important that is. Cox is the target. And he doesn't let him down, marking in opposition to Andrews because you see Collingwood are sliding numbers back but also covering the corridor really well so you've just got to be able to slice it's a kick mark game at the moment Cox beautiful palm down there to go you Crocker goes for Cox down the line bit of body work on Thompson two big lumbering blokes going after it at ground level yeah good to watch it was a one-on-one -on -one contest at the top of the square Mason Cox again big contest sticky hands sire Pups it in the Cox vicinity. Yes! And as, soon, as soon as it's clicked for him in the game, being able to read the flight of the ball, he's become a devastating player. Eighth in the AFL for contested marks this season. 13-5 from a goal-kicking perspective. And look at him spin that on the wind. Greenwood to give Crisp a better angle at goal, we know. He's a big kick, but this would be beyond him. Hit up lead comes from Cox. They can go long to him. He can hit up on a lead. They can have the go. We've seen side bottom. We know Hoskin Elliott. We know Thomas. That's a great strength to have. And Mason Cox again. Not a long kick, but it's a straight kick. And they're so close now. It's part of our game, and I'm sure anyone's done it. Mason Cox, good hands. Worked hard in front of Hickey. Soccer off the ground, straight into the waiting arms of Talor. Cox is the biggest man there! In he comes from 30. Oh boy! Oh boy! It's a 29-point lead! Kill some clock. Murray heads wide. Mason Cox about to rise. That's and two. the big men don't get any smaller. He up and unders, wants to buy time for Cox to get to the right spot. He's got it! And when he marks it like that, you think that he could be... An incredible force of the game, don't you? Phillips on that left foot, not a bad kick. Now, Cox, did he get a contest going? McGovern ran goals in, and then Cox gets some back and rides him into the ground. He'll like that, the big guy. The goalie, prominent, looking for the sparing low ball. A big man got down low in Mason Cox. 6-4 from set shots, you can see there. Reliable, 35, got it. Pies will get around him. The big fella scores first here in terms of goals. He looks down the line towards Goldstein. Zebel Cox. And the big man takes it for the Pies. Ashbury back along the wing. Cox rises high. Takes another big mark. Out on the wing. He uses it for Hoskin Elliott. He had the touch as well, didn't he, Cox? That's a beautiful kick. Side bottom. Down the line, here he is again! Mason! Big telescopic Cox! Get that decision out of the way as quickly as possible. More to come on half-time on that. Well, thanks, BT. So, Adams back to Flynn Appleby. 
Schoenfeld made the contest. Handball back to Main. Lowers the eyes. Uses a teammate and Cox. Turn and go, Matheson. A little floater and Mason Cox with the reach. Three pies look at each other. They weren't sure exactly who was going to do what. How back to the wing. Cox, arms everywhere. Nan Curvis, arms wrapped around now. Feeling it and gone. That's a great effort for a big man. Player forward of the kicker here in Dacos. Everyone, Jetta deep, Cox tall. So here he is, looking for number four. Only 25 metres, but that's the angle. Blow me down. What about that from Mason Cox? He's kicked four. He, what could he possibly be thinking to himself, Mason Cox? Majek made the contest with Asprey, uh, with uh, Vlosten, I should say, back to Vlosten. Great tackle by you know who, the big guy from Texas through Oklahoma with a bit of USA bravado there. Bell Chambers just trying to get it rolling forward. Crisp alert to that. Cox could grab because Hooker had him in the right spot at the top of him. Back inside 50 to Mason Cox. Mitch Robertson on the mark. Struck it pretty well. Sneaks it in, Mason Cox. Thanks, Kingy Langdon. Goes for Cox and he takes a commanding mark. Last 50 seconds of a delicately placed opening turn. Langdon. Top of the ball, and here he is again, the big man. Boy, he's had a big day. He's getting a taste for it to make it five goals in a row. Essendon haven't kicked the goal since the 26th minute mark of the second quarter. And Cox gets his second, and the fans go crazy. The young Si was outstanding against Brisbane. 27 disposals and a goal, including 13 contested possessions. And there he is, trapping it, sending it back to the square. Equal numbers. Farco flashing through. Hoskin Elliott set it for Phillips. The elder, yeah, yep. so Tom is 23, Ed 22. Cox, good mark. How looking for Cox! No one went with him. Beautifully placed kick. Trelaw, sorry, at 39, and Phillips at 36. So Cox being dealt with there, and he says to Trengo, go away. You got it. I've been reported for rock Honda. I don't think they're looking to run time off the clock. I think they're just looking to get back in rhythm and in control. Cox again, I mean, it has been a colossus tonight. A long ball up to the height of Mason Cox, who controls it on the way down. And he's just too tall. He just dumps the long one down the line. Johnson behind Cox, and what an impressive when he long option he is. Almost a drop kick off the ground from Hoskin Elliott. It's picked off. Hardigan tries to poke it wide to Seedsman, but Mason Cox got in the way, having an influence in the opening term. Anyone else that gets over the top. <laughs> but he's doing it all. He's winning it in the middle. He's taking marks on the last line, contested marks defensively. And now he's kicked three goals. Side bottom got the releasing handball. Main sweeping through the middle. And they're really good and really disciplined at making sure that they move really quickly and reset themselves. Mason Cox, unbelievable stuff. 13 points to the margin there. Curvis crunch was pressed here and he saw feeling the heat out there, which is rising at the MCG. Barco the penalty to Thomas. He chips it down the middle. Cox! So Mason Cox. Big kick for the Pies. Kicked a couple last week. Kicks a big one here and now. Collingwood not going away at the MCG. Driving ball on the head of Cox. In comes Ashby. Flossed in there as well. Gee, that's a good mark. Sends Collingwood inside 50. Mason Cox feeds back. They need to find two more. Collingwood trying to deny them. Hawker, Cox, the one hand. What a shield. My check to Goey is simply the man. Levi Greenwood just pounds it back in. Side bottom now. Well done. Big Mason. Mightn't be paying that next year from what we hear. Oh, <laughs> right now, I reckon only Jimmy Steins in terms of international football is bigger than this guy. I think it's realistic that they can finish in that bottom half of the... 
of the eight. They'll just peel the handball back inside one at a time. It's perfect play. Now it's in the hands of the magician Pendlebury, and he finds Cox. Five seconds, so he started his move. Close to the man on the mark, he goals. He's enjoying that, the big fella. We're set up for a huge second half. Has to stick it up in the air. They want Cox, and they get him. They get him. Gee, that's a good mark. That's massive. That one down the line, I talk about it all the time. To find him. Hold the ball. Duck that. Hold it. Hold it there, Mason. No need to do it. No need to get involved. When ducked the head first, Mike. Time back on. Very popular figure yes. to give his away, and now he's giving he's, high fives to everyone. He's trying to find his countryman, uh, Matt Damon, yeah. who's in the crowd tonight. But uh, Big Coxie, he's making the most of this, and he's just realised that uh, they're waiting for me. I'll better get <laughs> in. Right. <laughs> Bit of me time there. Maybe they also said Matt, da Matt Damon's down in the rooms. Right side, and realised he doesn't like using it too much. Duck back inside, used the handball, and Cox again too tall. I reckon he's done. I know he's going to kick, if he kicks this, more goals than he's ever kicked in a game, but I still reckon there's been a few other games where he's done well. A handful for the first time in his career. Mason's got five. And he's very happy with that too, just look at that. Oh, he's just getting a little look, look of uh, easiness about him, and uh, this guy might just actually doing wobble it. off if he wobbles anymore. <laughs> Jeez, uh... Taken to himself quickly. <laughs> there were four Bulldogs players around to go in the middle. Knocked down beautiful Cox to Adams on the move. High ball towards the wing. Mason Cox in from the side. Colling, Collingwood. Advantage, Advantage will be paid. Advantage. And the big man's away. Once again, they look to turn the defence around to Stevenson. Maynard, long ball, Cox getting back. What a mark. What a contested mark. And he takes a look at Barras and says, see... I can do it. Now the mark, he kicks it low and it's a little rip right, but it's a goal, he's kicked two. Look at the big man. Three goals in the quarter for Collingwood, one to West Coast. Do you reckon this will get a run on American TV this last half? It's an enormous performance by him. Oh, there's a very old saying, the tall players don't get shorter late in games. Well, Mike Pike said about him, you can't teach height. So, Crocker's kick, and Cox has taken a very good mark. Tigers kick the last three of the afternoon. Pendlebury through traffic, and again, it's Mason Cox who's found inside 50. The goey hunting after the football, and going short. And it's over the head of Mason Cox. A tough thing to do, but it'll sit up for the American, who's on the burst, inside 50, on the fly, Mason Cox! Sets it up, Cox again. I cannot believe it. You've got to go back to Billy Graham at the MCG for an American to dominate like this. The crowd is chanting USA as well. Oh. <laughs> can he guide it through? Yes, he can. Three of the very best. It's astonishing. It's one of the greatest stories, I reckon, in Australian football unfolding before our very eyes. And Collingwood will go in to the 2018 Grand Final, a famous victory on the back of this man here. Mace, what is it about these big games? You seem to save your best for the biggest crowd, the biggest stage. Uh, usually my family's in town, so maybe I go back there. I'm not really sure, but I think I just got a bit of a different mindset. Most of the boys aren't stressed out too much about it, just kind of focus on the little things.